and judging by their inventory, this is not a new sight for them. Even though we only get a tiny glimpse of things outside, we've already seen so much that can help contextualize things. So immediately, a big question arises. Where is the Red Arch? Commenters begin to speculate. Dragoon asks what the Red Arch is and that it's not even there. Ninja Pope asks, anyone see that thing around the corner? To which Ordisi answers, it's a chest. Acker asks for an interview. On a whim, I took a page out of Acker's book and sent them a friend request and message on Discord. They were offline, but there was the slightest chance I could get some answers from them. In the meantime, though, Google was the key. Nothing popped up on images, save for a few different bedrock escape rooms, some random help requests, and lots of generally unrelated things. Until one picture caught my eye. Wait, no way. You see that too, right? It's like a stronghold. So just to really confirm my theory, I found all the structure pieces of a stronghold and cross-referenced them with the original video. Yeah, that's like half a library. I think these chains right here are this room right here. There's just tons of libraries, really. Look at that. So the issue that's got me stung, one of the rooms just doesn't exist in a stronghold. This L-shaped room. Huh. Who put that there? But then I got sent a message that changed everything. <coughs> so what does Acker mean? ready, but this was like really weird to me. Acker, who knows more than anyone about what happened, is just shooting me down. So I changed gears. Okay, what do you remember? That's it? You're not asking the right questions. Well, what should I be asking? Is that not the obvious question? Like, what do you... Okay, you left the call. Great. Is that an IP address? server was normal, just a bit old. The, the place looked like one of those buildings you would make in the first version of Minecraft DE, like when you only had bricks, glass, and like wood. It must have been 10 years old, and yet it was still online. I checked out all the bases, but the only one that had a sign said it was graphs, so no lead there. But there were tons of structures to check out. One pyramid had bedrock on top, there were some super inefficient stairs, there was this structure. Even weirder was this castle that had the brightest bedroom I've ever seen. Overall, 10 out of 10 server. Very sketchy. I just love the monument to greed sitting right next to spawn. Is that all gold? Oh, but when a skeleton killed me and I couldn't find anything, I came up with a better plan. I should find the strong one. 1.12 makes the whole beating the game process a little harder, but with some resources from around the server and an hour or two of free time, So let's consider this real quick. The Minecraft world is a blank canvas of broken rules, and yet strongholds simply don't spawn under spawn. That was the final nail. There was something useful down there. <coughs> I started by once again cross-referencing the room pieces by memory to see if any of them were out of shape, like that L-shaped one, or if I could find a similar Mental area fit. in Vale's video before they walked into that room. None of them were shaped like it. None of them were out of place, except one room at the bottom of some stairs. Nah, I did not just skip it. Nah. Damn, this taking a while. I fucking broke the level. That's crazy. Easy. Give me that 10 bucks.